the lateral border that is also arising from the dorsal surface this muscle i am cutting it out this one is teres major as well as teres minor the two muscles that take origin from the dorsal surface is scapula the lateral border that is teres major and minor border. this muscle you are seeing is teres major it's going here and getting inserted onto the medial lip of the intertubercular sulcus right teres major so teres major takes origin from the lower half of the lower half or lower two uh, lower two third of the lateral border of the scapula on the dorsal surface then these fibers it also is contributing to the posterior wall of the axilla and then it winds and gets inserted onto the medial border of the intertubercular sulcus think about teres major if it's moving out like this from here till here what will be the action of teres major it is coming from behind scapular region participating in the posterior wall of axilla and getting inserted here in anteriorly on the humerus the intertubercular sulcus medially so what it will do it will it will cause medial rotation of the humerus or the medial rotation of the arm at the shoulder joint that's one of the main action and if your hands are abducted it will also help in adducting so adduction and medial rotation are the two major actions of teres major what will be the nerve supply for this muscle teres major remember deep down below to the scapula on the under surface which muscle takes origin here under surface of scapula subscapular so it's not what is the nerve supply for subscapularis kya hoti hai upper and lower subscapular nerve okay so the lower scapula subscapular nerve also descends down to supply teres major that is the nerve supply for teres major lower subscapular nerve okay Thank you.